Florida and the Orlando market specifically offer an investor um, a great alternative to other markets in the U.S. And here's why. Um, Florida in general has a very business friendly tax environment. Uh, in overall business climate is very friendly. Uh, there is no state income tax. So there's a lot of people that we see migration moving from places like New York, example state of New York, over 50,000 people a year are leaving the state of New York for the state of Florida. Uh, businesses are relocating here. Uh, we have a very friendly environment, um, low business taxes, low startup costs. Um, the state is actually running at a surplus and they have over a billion dollar surplus. Uh, Orlando market has a lot of benefits. It right now is one of the fastest growing cities in America. It's one of the um, fastest growing job markets in America. In fact, Forbes magazine in October named Orlando the number one uh, job growth market in the United States. So you're hearing Orlando right there with Austin, Texas in population and job growth. And what's bringing people to Orlando? I think that's what a lot of people seem to be wondering. And other than having a great business friendly environment, um, having fantastic weather year round, people are coming to Orlando because it generally is, has a lower cost of living than a lot of major cities. And as far as business is concerned, there are, um, Florida's come back very quickly. It's a state that uh, has focused on its assets and resources. Uh, it, it really um, backed the tourism market. And what we learned is that tourism is somewhat discretionary income, but people are willing to go spend money on a family-friendly tourist environment as soon as they have money in their pocket. So they might avoid that trip to Europe, but Florida and Orlando specifically offer a cheap alternative or a better, more cost-effective alternative. So the state of Florida backed that, and now the state of Florida is gonna have near, it's nearing 100 million visitors a year, Orlando actually being the most visited city in the world now, uh, approaching nearly 60 million visitors uh, at the end of 2014. So the state recognized its assets, it started backing tourism, and tourism led to job growth. Uh, we're seeing tourism go upscale, Four Seasons just opened its largest resort in the world this summer in Orlando. Uh, Orlando has a Waldorf Astoria, has a lot of upscale brands that have come here saying, this is, this is the new tourism market. Uh, Orlando has other industries besides tourism, such as healthcare. Healthcare is huge in the Orlando area. There's actually a project called Lake Nona, the medical city. It's the largest healthcare development in the United States taking place right now. New hospitals, new cancer research, all of this is happening right here in Orlando. The tech industry is, a lot of people think Silicon Valley and New York City is tech, big tech markets. Orlando, the number two industry is technology. So I think the real estate opportunity is there and I think it's gonna be here for a while. Regarding property management, a lot of our clients will ask us how do we handle the property management on a granular level because that's what it boils down to. That's what makes your returns. You can buy a great house in a great area, but it needs to be managed right. Uh, we do criminal background. We do sex offender searches. We do credit checks. Uh, so we really try to find the right tenants. So what we generally are doing are finding homes that need light cosmetic work. We stay away from homes that need major structural issues or have structural issues and things like that. What we're doing is a uh, light cosmetic renovation, we're getting the homes inspected, checking heating and air, roofs, hot water heaters, all your system, all your big ticket items. We strongly recommend a uh, home inspector on each and every home. We also do termite inspections as well. So we try to uncover what are all the secrets of this home. Let's now go and renovate the home. Let's fix those items. Uh, and then when we're renovating the home, we'll actually begin the property management process during that renovation. So. Uh, in a lot of cases, like the home that we're at right now, the renovation isn't complete, but there's a sign in the front yard. So we're already advertising it. And as we were walking into this home, we had somebody stop us on the street and ask about the home. And it really puts the, uh, the timeline for leasing the home, it shortens that. Generally speaking, the homes that we target will rent in 30 days or less. And you know there is a little bit of variance, maybe 14 days on either side of that. Sometimes they rent very quickly. A lot of it has to do with the time of year and when the, exactly when the home hits the market. We, we use PropertyWare. PropertyWare is a, uh, a software for property management companies. It helps assist with marketing, uh, billing, etc. Um, on the marketing aspect, it'll syndicate the properties uh, to 
uh, Zillow and, and Craigslist and all the places that you would possibly find a rental property online. So we do that syndication. We also will market the properties on the most multiple listing service and uh, give you the maximum exposure for your home. So that's important to us. As far as um, taking applications, as mentioned, we will have the, the tenants, we'll go through all the screening and the background checks, all those things that, that are really important to make sure that uh, your tenant is qualified. We'll check their income, make sure that they can afford the home. Uh, what's great about using the PropertyWare system for you is you get to see all these things happening in PropertyWare. When we upload a lease, you'll get a notification. When a tenant makes a payment, you'll get notifications. We can, we can throttle those a little bit, so sometimes uh, you're getting too many notifications. So we might have just big ticket items, if you, uh, such as a major repair request or um, you know, if we're having to collect on a tenant, something like that, we'll, we'll notify you. Uh, but what's great about it is you can actually communicate uh, to the property management team directly through PropertyWare. The tenants can communicate through PropertyWare. We strongly encourage the tenants get set up on automatic drafting. So there's no uh, running around, collecting rent, doing that. That's, that's all old school, you know. Uh, we'll generally do a 12-month lease uh, with the option for the tenant to renew at that point. And um, it's, it's pretty cut and dry from there. We collect a one-month security deposit that's held in escrow and uh, is billed for the tenant if there's any damages. Uh, a lot of people ask about pets, and I think everybody probably has an opinion. Uh, our opinion is a lot of tenants are pet owners. That's to your discretion. If you don't want pets, that sort of thing, we're going to tailor the property management as much as we can to your, your individual liking. But we'll make strong recommendations of what's worked for us thousands and thousands of times in the, in the past. So um, I think that pretty much summarizes our, how we handle property management.